find yourself wishing you had a little help picking out embroidery colors on the Bernina 880, I have got to show you this color wheel feature. So what we're talking about, and we're just going to go and pick a built-in design. I'm actually going to pick it from the folder. And there's this little lion here that's quite elaborate. And you can kind of see it's kind of got more of a maroon and gray coloring. But what if you wanted to switch those up and really see something, maybe you want it to more green or more orange. You can come right over here to the color palette. So we do see that this design has three colors. You can actually go ahead and touch and change each of these colors to the isocord thread that you actually have. So these, if you wanted to see what it's going to look like if you did it in a darker color and then you're going to change out your the next color, you can actually go in and and pick the colors you want it to do. But let me show you what this does. So see right up here at the top, the color wheel will allow you to actually give this a spin and you can see how things would look if you had a different kind of, it's like it takes the complementary colors, you can do brightness and then you can do different colors. So all of a sudden, if you were more of a green person, you can see what it's gonna look like before you even go, oh, I wonder how green's gonna look and you stitch it out and then you realize, oh, I don't like that. You can actually come in and maybe you want more of a yellow tone or maybe more of a darker gold tone. So you can actually just sit here and play around with each of these different kind of color groupings and twist it until you find one that just is totally something you know you're gonna love once you put the red to it. So you can actually add your own colors. Um, that might take a while if you have a lot of a lot of color changes. This one only had three, so that was fairly easy. But I am a big fan of that color wheel because as soon as you come out and come back to where we were in the editing, then those are the colors that are gonna show on screen. So don't forget that little color palette. It sits right here and I will tell you, sometimes I forget about it, but it is so convenient convenient when you want to get a totally different look to a design and the default colors are not doing it for you.